pull up a, a cheat code with it too. So you know what I mean? I'm plotting that right now as well. GTF, what's good? Another day, another video. What's going on? What's going on, fam? Another beautiful day. Like I always say, man, if you if you woke up today, you are blessed. You hear me? No matter what you're going through, you are blessed. What's good though, man? What's going on, man? Get what? Y'all see I got the hoodie on, right? Today, man, I don't know what we gonna do with Florida, man. Florida is being unpredictable right now. Like I said, this is gonna be going on from December to March. Woke up this morning and the temperature is in the 50s. You're in the 50s, man. I can't take it, man. I feel like I ought to fly somewhere warm, you I feel like, I feel like I should fly, I ought to fly to somewhere warm right about now, man. It's too cold out here for me, man. It's like 50 something degrees right now, man. Can't take it, man. I feel like an iguana, you You know what I'm saying? You know how they say when they get cold, iguanas can't move. That's how I be getting. You understand me? I be, I don't be wanting to move, but you know, I gotta, I gotta get up and I gotta make things happen. You know what I'm saying? I gotta, I gotta stay on the grind, so I can't stay in bed or what have you. But I see, I see where the iguanas be coming from, man. When when they say it get freezing, iguanas can't move or they get immobilized or whatever. How that situation works. You understand me? That's exactly how I be feeling. You heard me, but. But, but I know I gotta get up. I know I gotta get up. I gotta make things happen. But yeah, man, we in traffic with it right now, as you can see. You know what I mean? We in traffic with it right now. You know what I'm saying? About to make my rounds, run my errands, or what have you. Um, Today, I saw somebody in the comments. One of the one of the GTF members in the comments said something about yo, cause like I be I be reading the comments when I get a chance. Sometimes it be too much to try to read the comments, cause I be doing so much. But I read the the comments when I when I get a chance. So the other day somebody commented and they said, "Yo, you need to try Huey Magoo's." I wish I had a screenshot of the comment so I could have posted up on the screen. But uh, I didn't get a chance to screenshot it. Somebody said, "Yo, you need to try Huey Magoo's." So when the person said Huey Magoo's, I'm like, "That's a weird name." So I googled it, I looked it up, and I realized, okay, cool. You feel me? It's like a a chicken finger type of spot, like like a like a like a Zaxby's or Raising Cane's type of spot. And the thing with this one is closer to me because the nearest Zaxby's is an hour away, hour north, and the nearest Raisin Cane's is an hour south from me. You understand what I'm saying? So I looked up Huey Magoo's, and it happened to be like, yo, like this ain't nothing but like 15, 20 minutes away. I'm like, okay, cool. This is even better. So, you know what I mean? Depending on how it tastes, I might be messing with Huey Magoo's from now on. You understand me? Depending on if I like it or not, because. Trying to drive an hour to Zaxby's or an hour to Raisin Cane's, man, it's, it's kind of crazy. You understand know what I'm saying? So that's what we're doing today. Uh, I'm trying to see if I could develop a, a cheat code with it, too. So, you know what I mean? I'm plotting that right now as well, because I know y'all be feeling the cheat codes or what have you. So I'm trying to see if I could develop a cheat code right now while I'm driving on the road. Because sometimes when I drive, I be thinking, you feel me? So that's what it is right now, man. So we on the road with it right now. You understand? Know About to make my rounds or what have you. You understand know me? Let go. All right, fam, we done running errands, man. It's about that time to head out. We'll go do this video real quick, man. So the name of the restaurant we headed to is called Huey Magoo's. Yeah. Somebody pointed that restaurant out to me the other day. I saw the comment. Somebody commented on the channel or on TikTok or what have you. And uh, the person said, man, you need to go try a Huey, Huey Magoo's. So the name just stood out to me. So the name stood out to me. I'm like, Huey Magoo's? I'm like, what is that? So I Googled it. I put it on Google Map, and I'm like, wow, we don't got a... It's not too far from me, you feel me? About 20, 25 minutes from me. Like, you know what? We gonna go try that out, you feel me? Huey Magoo's is sort of like another... It's a chicken finger spot. It's sort of like a... It's like a Zaxby's or a Raisin Cane's from the pictures that I was seeing. That's what I'm getting from it, you understand what I'm saying? But uh, some of the people who I saw, I saw some reviews on it or whatever, and people saying that it's better, so... About to go try it out, you understand what I'm saying? We about to go to Huey Magoo's. You understand? But we on the road with it right now. See, we in traffic here. I ain't gonna lie, there's a lot of traffic out here, man. It's only 12 in the afternoon, man. Shouldn't everybody be at work? I know everybody ain't off today. It's Wednesday. You understand me? It's Wednesday. But yeah, man, we on the road with it right now. We in traffic. But I ain't gonna lie to y'all, fam. Like, if you think about moving to Florida, man, fam, GTF, I love y'all. I love y'all, right? But if y'all think about me moving to Florida, please don't do it, man. We full down here, man. We full. It's a lot of traffic. Traffic be congested. You understand what I'm saying? So, we full down here, man. We full. Don't do it. Don't come Don't come down here. No disrespect. I love y'all. You understand me? But, but don't move down here, man. We full, man. We, we too congested down here. Yeah. All 
All right, fam, we almost there, man. We about 13 minutes out, man. We just got off the exit, exit 33B. North Lauderdale, you North Lauderdale, Florida, you You understand me? We almost there. But I ain't gonna lie to y'all, though, man. Like, it ain't as far as going trying to go to Zaxby's, though. But it's a little trip, though. I ain't even gonna cap with you. It's a little trip, though. I feel like it took me a little minute to get. Although, I ain't gonna lie. I'm coming from down south right now, so. I ain't gonna lie. Kind of feel like a little trip. Hey, fam, when you guys, for you guys out there that drive, when you out there on that road, like, how do you guys feel driving next to, uh, to the trucks. I mean, this is not a tractor trailer. This is a um, this is a box truck. But when it comes to driving next to tr to, to box trucks, tractor trailers, do you guys get nervous or what have you? Do you want to hurry up and get out of there? Hurry up and get away from it or whatever? Let me know how y'all feel about that, man. Because I ain't going to lie to y'all. I mean, when I be seeing them tractor trailers on the road, you feel me? It be having me feeling kind of nervous, you heard? I be feeling kind of nervous. And I ain't going to lie to you, too. I, I, got, I got my CDL. I got my CDL. I, I, I can drive tractor trailers. Although I don't do it, but I do have my CDL, you understand me? But when I pull up next to a tractor trailer, like, I kind of feel nervous. Like, you go one right here next to me right now. I be feeling kind of nervous driving next to the tractor trailer, you understand me? But that's how I be, though. I feel nervous driving next to him, but I don't feel nervous when I'm driving the tractor trailer. You understand me? But let me know how y'all feel about driving next to the tractor trailers, dude. All right, fam. We finally here, you're the Huey Magoo. Your destination is on the right. Destination is on the right. Stop somewhere. Yeah, I guess not. I ain't never been a part of this. This is North Lauderdale area. I've never been to this part of Lauderdale before. You understand me? I think I'm gonna go through the drive through. I just wanna show y'all the front real quick. Hold on one second. I'm gonna show y'all the front of it before. Mm -hmm. I just wanna show y'all the front of it before, right quick. What y'all see right here? Huey Magoo. Man, so I got the grub, you heard? Got the grub, just walked out of Huey Magoo's. And I ain't gonna lie to you, off the dribble, Magoo's got me hot. And the reason I say this, I bought a five piece tender meal, five piece sauce tenders, and in total, I spent $16.29. I ain't gonna cap with you, that's kinda hot, boy. That's kinda hot. Jeez. Here's the receipts right here, as you can see. Five sauce tenders, fifteen twenty-three. Out of the five sauce tenders, I got three hand breaded and two grilled lemon pepper flavoring. That was fifteen twenty-three. And I bought a fountain drink. The fountain drink should have came with. I don't understand what's going on here. The final drink was $2.99. In total with taxes and everything, $16.29. Fam, it's, it's, it, it, it is very expensive to eat these days, bro. This is crazy. I ain't gonna lie, for the amount of money I spent, the amount of money I just spent, this thing better be hitting, you heard? Fam. I ain't gonna lie, I just did a fire chico with this Huey Magoo's, you heard? I ain't gonna lie, it was good. You know what I mean? It was tossed in lemon pepper, all that, the lemon pepper flavoring, seasoned right, or whatever, what have you. But I ain't gonna lie, $16 was still expensive. But it, nonetheless, it was still good though, you feel me? Y'all see the aftermath? Y'all gonna have to catch the results on the short video. But like I said, man, $16. That was pretty steep, you heard? No cap. But anyway, GTF for life.